Well, good morning, everyone. All right. So have you guys ever had a moment where you take a look at your first paycheck and you're just wondering what all the taxes are for? Or your car's ever broken down and you just didn't know what the problem is and you always got called AAA? You know, wasn't this a problem that you know you wish you had learned in, in school? These important events that are inevitable in our everyday adult lives are being avoided in our educational systems. Even though college prepares us for you know, general education courses, they lack giving us the knowledge to stay ahead of the adult world. I myself have experienced some of these things such as selective service and other, and other forms of taxes that I didn't know about in school. Um, so my thesis is that colleges should take their time out of the curriculum to teach us about these important things that we're going to need to know as adults. Uh, next slide, please. So first, I'll discuss the current conditions of school today. Uh, second, I will talk about the changes that need to occur. And finally, I'll tell you guys a little bit about the results that will uh, happen if the school applies these changes. So new college students, especially freshmen, are are lacking the knowledge they require to survive as independent adults. Now school, they do teach us about some important things such as famous novels, the Pythagorean theorem, but honestly, like, other than math majors, when are you gonna use that in real life, right? Mm -hmm. So, but it still doesn't change the fact that students don't know the fundamentals about being independent adults. Uh, next slide, please. Now, college students are even told about many career opportunities, yet there are, no, there are no forms of courses or study halls that teach us about how to build our resumes or even apply for inter internships. I, there are uh, workshops that students do have the option to go to today, but the key word is option. If given the option, most students will go to them compared to having a course required for students to attend and, and learn about these uh, specific teachings. Um, now I'll discuss a, kind of about, about the changes that we need to um, apply for the curriculum. Uh, next slide, please. So college, college classes and professors, they are expensive, and in today's economy, it is understandable why some of these courses are, be, are, being, cut, are being cut from school. But teaching students about the fundamentals of being adults, it, it should not take long whatsoever. Even for transfer students that are, that are required to take mandatory exams into, be, into being students here, or students who are being um, required to take the University 101 exams, these, these examples can be, can be used to, te to teach some of these um, lessons such as banking, internships, taxes, and even purchasing uh, property. And these courses can take, you know, maybe one class, maybe, maybe even a single week. Uh, next slide, please. I've taken a survey of students here at Cal State LA out of 100. 67% of students say they don't know everything that there is to know about paying for their taxes or, or their banking situations. The 33% do, most of which were already graduate students or seniors. Next slide, please. Now, so, now, some student, now some schools do understand that this is a problem. Like, like for example, uh, during high school, I take in an AVID program, which helps students prepare for applying for college. Now, th now this was a very interesting course, and it's only, so why is it only being used in some high schools? And why are these teachings about moving forward in life only being limited to a very limited amount of high schools? Why not all high schools and all colleges to help prepare students to get on their feet and move ahead in life? Uh, next slide, please. And finally, I'll talk to you a little bit about you know, results and the final changes that uh, need to occur. So, so with the survey, asking students if they would like the school to add a class that teaches these students about the fundamentals of adult life, every single one of them said, yes, we should, this is a class I would love to take. If these concepts are applied to our educational systems, students
students can be prepared and be more informed to take care of and maintain taxes. They'll be, they'll be better informed about making decisions that affect not only individual futures, but our nation's future, such as voting, purchasing a house, or purchasing a car. And because students will also be informed about, about all these things uh, that are required of being independent adults, that no, students will no longer have to rely on their parents or other, or other sources that, that are potentially unreliable. This gives students a sense of independence that, that, are, that actually get, gives a boost of self-esteem as well. And, and, and because of that, activity, activity in, the, in our generation will increase in exponentially. Um, next slide, please. So in conclusion, colleges should take their time out of the curriculum to add, to add a course like this for, uh, to prepare students for the inevitable events in our adult lives. I discussed about the current conditions, about how school is today and how, and how the students are learning. I uh, talked to you guys a little bit about the changes that, that can occur that, that aren't even asking a whole lot. It, this can be possible and it can be done. And finally, I talked to you guys a little bit about the results. So I want, I want everyone to, think, to take a look back, you know, think about a problem that, that, you've occur, that you've experienced and think, could I have learned this in school? Who did I go to for help? I want you guys to join me in convincing the school's educational program into, into adding a course like this to better prepare our generation for, for the future. And, and also think about your future. How would you uh, pay for your housing payment or take care of your mortgage? Don't ask me. College hasn't taught me yet. Thank you.